Toby kind of reminded me of me, you know, just having a very difficult life early on. I don't know, I just liked him, you know, I mean, <laughs> he tried to bite me and I still liked him. Toby was with us uh, for about four years. Um, that length of time for a dog uh, was kind of like being confined. Uh, we try to give him the best warm, loving home here as possible, temporary home here as possible. But the longer an animal is in the shelter for, um, the more it affects their behavior. It was a long process. Uh, first, um, Nicole and I would work with him by ourselves out here, getting him used to me. Once a dog is here in our facility, um, they stay here. Uh, like Toby Wan Kenobi had some trust issues. Um, we worked with him. He started trusting certain staff members. He was a great dog. He was just very misunderstood. Thanks to somebody like David Payne who came in and worked with him. We worked for about two and a half months. So if you're going to adopt a red dot dog, as they're called, make sure you have patience. I thought I'd do well with it, and I have patience. I'm retired. <laughs> he is happy. He is a dog now. And just what a difference um, his health is. He's so much friendlier. He lets people touch him now. He's got more trust in people because somebody did come in and adopt that dog and show him trust and show him love and show him a warm home. I've adopted these two from the SPCA. Both of them were red dot dogs. You know, as long as I got the dogs around, um, I, I know they need me and that's what I need is someone to need me.